So I guess we go up into this room first. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Seven Days to Die. This is the Insane Nightmare series. I'm the Bearded OG, and in this episode, we're going to go do uh, the junkyard place over there. Salvage place, Bart Salvage, I think it's called. Uh, and just keep working on jobs and also working on clearing the POIs in this town. Uh, so I did a bunch of mining uh, since, I, uh, since the, we recorded the last episode, primarily focusing on... Um, Let's see, coal and nitrate. Uh, so I'm making a, a bunch of gunpowder in here. We're making some more nine mil rounds, enough to you know have a full stack of that. And then I still have another 500 um, ish coal and nitrate that I'm just gonna hang on to. In the forge, I am beginning to smelt stone because we need to start thinking about concrete. Hopefully, um, you know we we can get that before the next horde nights. Uh, wh whether I, you know, end up buying one from the trader or we end up being able to make it, I guess the we'll make it by finding Forge Ahead books, and we'll get Forge Ahead books by increasing advanced engineering. So, speaking of which, uh, we do have another skill point to spend, and uh, let's see what I think. I think we have, yeah, we have living off the land. We're gonna do that. And I may actually put something into well insulated too. And we're gonna, I'm, we're, I'm almost sure we're gonna need this eventually, because uh, you know I do plan to ultimately live in the desert, and it's gonna be hot in the desert, of course. So yeah, um, we also have a couple of uh, challenges to do. So uh, I, I finally crafted the charred meat, so we got that done, and then um, we have. Uh, gather coal, so I got all the coal that this uh, challenge required, and I got all the nitrate this challenge required. So that gets us caught up on those, and we're already really close to hitting the next level. So I think for that next level, we will indeed go ahead and put that into well insulated, and then after that, we'll start focusing on one of these um, attribute trees and strength. Oh, there, there's a lot of good reasons to do sh to start focusing on strength. We can get shotguns up, we can get skull crusher up, we can get 69er and mother load up. I don't usually put more points into Master Chef because this game typically seems like it's pretty easy to to max out on the magazines. And of course, you know, doing so would make things a little cheaper. Yeah, 40% less recipe, cook faster, but in the long run, that stuff doesn't really matter a whole lot to me. Um, so we got that. We also have things here in perception that would be, you know, we, we want to eventually get into more. And, um, but I think most likely strength will be what we'll, we'll first focus on. Okay. So let's go ahead and get this party started here. And the name of the game again is just to do POIs, whether we're doing them as trader quests or just randomly doing them to get this town cleared, because that's a goal that I set for myself because I can. <laughs> That's why. All right. So, Bart Salvage, I think uh, I actually have been in here and looted most. Uh, did I? Did we not come? Oh, look at that. Could have sworn I came in here a long time ago and looted it. I guess the loot could have respawned, but I didn't. I don't think I changed the respawn rate of loot. And isn't it 30 days by default? We've only gone by 16 days. Maybe it, maybe not. I don't know. I could be completely off my rocker here. Uh, do we still get iron ingots by taking this apart? I don't remember. It looks like probably not. It looks like we're just going to get scrap iron. Yeah, just get scrap iron. Okay. I do remember coming in here and going up, you know, to, to there. But, yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know. 
Let's take this car apart, and then we'll go ahead and just start proper. Oh, you know what I think it might be? When I first started the series, we I think we were on built like build four, and then they came out with build fourteen. So maybe changing the build reset the POI. That could very well be what the issue is there. Not that that's an issue. That's a good thing. Um, but that may explain, you know, what the deal is with that. Okay, let's go ahead and get this get this thing started here. What do we have? Bar brawler. Okay. I didn't even bother reading that because I've just never been much of a fan of hand-to-hand -hand combat in this game. I always kind of leave something to be desired. I suppose I shouldn't say that until I've tested out in 1.0, you know, or 1.1, but and historically I haven't been very impressed with it. We'll put it that way. Maybe it's better. I am going to probably start hanging on to sand, too, just because I do want to start making concrete here pretty quick. Let's switch those over. I mean, st sand is still a low priority overall if we have to prioritize, but we'll hang on to it if we can. Is there something up here? Um, let's get this ready just in case. Not seeing anything up here. Whilst we're up here, uh, is there anybody we could snipe a doodle? I uh, can't really see anything from here. Let's go out onto the roof. I thought when we were here earlier, I saw a zombo out there in the yard. But if I... Oh, yep, yeah, I do see a Zeke. Okay. Right over there. Let's get our rifle out. All right. Well, we didn't one-shot him, but we softened him up anyway. For a way to get down from here without breaking our leg. I guess we could jump down on to here. And then shoot him right through the door. Okay, that got somebody else's attention. I see three red dots. Where are you? Oh, oh somewhere over on the other side of there. Oh shit, what was that? I don't know what that noise was, but it's kind of scary. Let's close that door. Lockpicks, that's good. More lockpicks. A little bit of cloth action. Let's take this apart. Uh, what does this give us? Plastic. Okay. Um, all right. Let's go back down here and close this. And we'll check this stuff. Um, that's not an upgrade because we have a, an iron shovel. So we won't worry about that. And none of that stuff's lootable. Do we have a better chance of getting a, a wheel if we use a wrench on those, or does it not matter? Oh, we got a radiator out of that. That's pretty good. Get some more iron from this. Plastic.
take that apart. Okay. Check this trash here. Oh, look at that. Nice. Why don't we repair that and then chuck this. And I guess I'll put the engine in in here. You've unlocked armor. Heavy armor's quality one. Oh, nice. Okay, so that means we can now make the actual armors. Uh, where's the where's the crafting menu? Here we go. Oh, do we? I bet you we have to do it in the. We probably have to do it in the workbench, don't we? Okay. Something to think about. Um, we do need to. I do, rather, need to start paying attention to armors because the benefits that they will offer us uh, can be good. Let's make sure we're fully loaded with all of our weaponry here. Incidentally, I did get attacked uh, in the mine overnight by a feral Hawaii 5-0, and I just about bought the farm, but my AK saved my ass. I wasn't recording at the time because I was just mining, so I didn't get it on camera, unfortunately, but it scared the shit out of me. Alright, that's a jiggly. I figured there'd probably be a dog here. Oh shit, biker. I don't like bikers. No, I don't. They're scary. They they really get caught up on the on that backhoe, don't they? Or whatever the hell that thing is. We're not quite ready to take bikers on head to head. You guys saw a few episodes ago how tough those mofos are, man. Uh, all right, so what are we going to do here? I mean, I could spray and pray him with the AK, I suppose. Can... Can they, can they not get up here? The dog was able to get up here, so why can't the Zeeks? All right, he's dead. Yeah, I don't want to take any chances with him. Phew, okay. We're not done yet. Oh, we're going to have to go down in a bunker. Nice. That's going to be fun. All right, let's go down here. Loot this stuff. Get the plastic and the paper. Get a nice little pile of paper from those recycled cardboard pallets. There's a pretty decent amount of resources in this place. stuff I could be wrenching too that I could come back for later. The You can't wrench those. I think those uh, will just break down into scrap iron. I don't think you get parts from them. You do from fridges and stuff though. Okay, we gotta watch our encumbrance. What I might uh, actually do is just go put a drop chest down before we go down there so we can move. Is there anything up here? Some iron and just some trash and stuff. Nothing else. Okay. Now they just about took this thing out, didn't they? Might as well take it down the rest of the way. Locked. 
Okay, we can't put anything in there. Let's just put some stuff in here. Uh, no, we don't want to save that. We don't need to save that. Mm, I mean, I've got like a full stack of rotting flesh, so I don't think I'm going to save that either. Okay, that's good enough. Um, I hope that chicken stays there. Of course, if a Zeke comes by, it'll eat it, but... Um, why did, why did I bother breaking that down when I could have just gone through the door? Can't take me anywhere. Okay, well, let's go down here. Uh, I don't remember exactly what's down here or what's going to happen, but whatever it is, it can't be good. Oh, shit, we're going to have to drop down there. Fuck. I don't know if how else to get in here. There's probably some kind of exit somewhere else, but I don't know where it is. All right, well... We'll have this ready to go for the first shot, and then we'll quickly hit number six to go to this. Five, six, and then if we need a backup, we go to four. Four, five, six. Those are our lifesavers. Four, five, six. Don't forget that, OG. Four, five, and six. Uh, you know what? I don't need to be carrying these around anymore at all because we now have the wonderful helmet light. I also don't need that either. All right, here we go. Okay, so at least we don't get ambushed immediately. Ooh. Uh, I think that's just a corpse. This kind of reminds me a little bit of the old style bunker. But getting down here is different than it used to be. Okay. There's a trap door there and some flame over there. Guess we go in here first. Oh no, that door's locked. Guess we don't go in there first. Let's close that. Can we go in here first? Nope, that door's locked. Are we even... Oh, well, that door's locked too. What the hell? Guess we have to go down the hatch, eh? Oh, that scared me. So it's just a crawler. Okay. Let's let him come up here and we'll dispatch him silently. You gonna come up the ladder? Can you come up the ladder? I've seen you climb up other things. Oh, well, you can do that too. <laughs> he can burn himself. We won't get the XP for it, but. Oh, shit. I don't remember this. This is like new, isn't it? Is it new? Have I been in this POI before? I kind of remember something like this POI in, uh, but I thought it was like from, uh, what's the big mod that adds all the POIs? The really popular one. I can't remember what it's called. Oh, I bet you we turn that off from here. Nope. Not from there. This place is cool, man. It's like uh, a lot more to it than it first appears. So I guess we go up into this room first. Shit. 
Um, all right. Edgar's the most dangerous of the two, so you go first. All right. I think, yeah, I was going to say, they can probably get up here. Got them done. Are they the only ones up here? All right, we are in some kind of a pantry or a supply room or something. Chicken soup. No recipe. We shall eat it. Activate red wall valve. Okay, that's probably what turns off the fire. Anything else significant in here? No. Still can't open that. Well, we know we know where we're going next. Well, I guess we could go this way. What's up with all the jigglies? You're loaded too? Okay. Okay. Bunker bathroom. Medical supplies. There's a valve too, but we can't, we can't turn it. So okay, there's Edgar there. Nobody in there. I see Edgar and Jiggly up there. What's up with all the floating loot? That's kind of weird. Um, all right. Can we shoot Jiggly in the head and one shot her? That's a nice view. Okay, I'm trying to be quiet so we don't wake up Edgar. Oh shit. Well, so much for that idea. We're still not done. There's more zombos around somewhere. There's a yellow, yep, there's a yellow thing that way. But we are in the fat loot's room. Find more food and loot. Okay, we got an improved fittings. Let's put that on here for now just to save. Oh, maybe we can only put that on like heavy armor. I'm guessing. This will repair and we'll sell it. Take some more nine mils. And uh, semi-mod a knife guy. Hunting knife quality one. All right, so now we can make the same quality of knife that we're currently using. So the next time we move up on that, we'll be able to actually make a better kniffy. All right, let's loot that. Okay. Shotguns do 10% more damage. Hell yeah. Yes, indeed. I will take that. All right, let's open this thing up. I wonder why they did away with Navis Gain Safeco and now their Beaver Box Safeco. I don't know. I don't know the answer to that question. Come on, you bastard. Mother. Yeah. 
There we go. Oh, that's nice. That is really nice. Since this is our oh shit weapon, um, why don't we... Okay, what's this do? Better accuracy for hip firing. And this is less recoil, which also translates to better accuracy. Um, we could put this on here because I typically will use my shotgun as my initial weapon and we hit them once with the rad remover and then that removes their regen ability for 90 seconds. So I think that's what we'll do because I kind of want to keep these two on the AK. Wait a second. Oh, I've got, I got two muzzle brake mods. Oh, nice. Okay. Well, in that case, we will put the other one here and we, we have the full auto mod there. And can we, can we put this on here? No, I don't think, I didn't think so. Okay. Sweet. Those are some nice upgrades, ladies and gents. Take them. Since this is a two block high ceiling, is there any loot up here? Uh huh, look at that. Bears will eat those right now. We're kind of hungry. Okay, let's get this party finished here. Okay, we see a lumberjack. In a blue guy. Can we take out blue guy without waking up lumberjack? Are we fully loaded? We're not. I'm glad I checked because whenever you mod a weapon, it unloads it. All right, let's see if we can get a, a one shot. We got a one shot. All right, if Larry the Lumberjack's the last one left, let's just take him out. Well, that's not Larry the Lumberjack. That's Steve in a flannel shirt. Ah, uh, sure, why not? We're almost done here. I'm assuming we're done with all the Zeeks. Look at that. Pipe shotgun quality five. We have a quality four. All right, that's probably worth making. I rather enjoyed this quest. It's definitely different. Then I remember it, anyways. I will take all of that as well. Oh, so this comes out in the garage. Oh, how about that? Okay. Well, that's good to know for future reference. I did not know that. Very nice. Let me grab all of that stuff, and I'll have to come back and get the rest of that later. I'm going to go drop this stuff off at the base, and then I'll meet you guys over at Trader Rect for our turn-in. All right, Recty Poo. What you got? I'll sell you. Didn't we agree your first job was going to be free? Um, I Damn. think all I can spare. That's, all that stuff's kind of lame, really. I mean, I guess we'll take the pipe bombs. So are you going to give me for a tier two quest? Dude, you suck. Okay, whatever. Um, my shop, my rules. We'll say you that. Follow, or you fuck off. And I think his inventory has reset. So let's take a quick look-see and see what he has. Does he have a cement mixer? 
He's got concrete itself. Got a crucible, but oh my god, look how expensive that thing is. Nope, no cement mixer. Okay. I might do a trip uh, to the other all traders that at goods and, that's all you and see if any of them has one. Uh, but what's this? I got some shit work for a fuck sweet, up like you. Sweet honey pot farm, well, sure. Good luck. Why not? We'll take it. Looks of it. You're gonna need it. All right, we have like over a thousand gunpowder now, which is awesome. Um, let's do another batch of nine mil. We'll make another stack. Well, I guess 256 is all we can make of those for now because I need to make more bullets, which is not a hard thing to do, but that should be good enough to get us going for now. Uh, let's eat a couple bacon and eggs because we are on the hungry side. And we're in pretty good shape for all of our other ammos. So let's go do this next quest. You know, I got to thinking about it. Um, I do I actually do remember Bart's salvage being in that configuration in vanilla. I just, just forgot about it. Hold on a sec. You have a sports bag or a duffel bag or whatever here. Let's grab that. Look at that. Nice. Steak and potatoes. Beautiful. Beautiful. All right. Honey pot farms. I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to deal with dogs here and probably pigs too. So let's go ahead and come around the front here. Salvage tools. We can now make a wrench. All right. Very nice. Um, let's hit this for honey. No honey. What's in here? Medical supplies. Okay, I think that's all we'll do for double looting. Let's go ahead and do this. This is a clear and a retrieve. Let's try for honey again. Huzzah. Got that. Do the medical supplies again. That's all good. So we'll grab that too. And then grab something out of the mailbox. Nine millimeter weapons degrade 20% slower. I'll take it. That does not suck. We'll put you in there and let's put... Um, here, let's turn you into this. Scrap this. All right. Everybody loaded? No, everybody is not loaded. I'm glad I decided to check that. That's loaded. That's loaded. That's loaded. Okay. What do we have in the books? Spear crafting. Yeah. Not a fan. Grab that. Grab these couches and chairs for the leather and, and or cloth. You know what I need to actually start getting a little more of those paper for shotgun shells because I haven't I've been doing a lot of that. Those people do kind of almost look all the same, don't they? <laughs> Wonder who, I wonder if those, wonder if these are actual people, you know, on the development team or something. All right, I s really, he's wandering around. Not anymore. Ronald McDonald. All right, then we have one more red dot over here somewhere. More books, Handyland, and Harvesting Tools. Stone Tools Quality 6. Okay, we're just about to the point where we can make Iron Level 1, and that way we can make a Fire Axe, then we'll be done with Stone Tools. 
There's a zombie doodle somewhere in here. Unless they're that's weird. Unless they're up above or something. Oh my god, scare me. Alright, let's see who we're dealing with first before we Edgar, stop that fucking crawling stuff. It's not allowed. And they gave us a sprained wrist. Son of a bitch. Take that, Steve. Oops. Alright, let's scrap that. Uh, oh, I must have looted that instead of reading it. Shit, I forgot the... You know what? I'm going to throw those away. They're easy enough to make. It's just taking up a slot that we no longer need to be taken up. All right, let's reload everybody. Bag here. Salvage tools. All right. Harvest this stuff. Zombie claws are right here. Can't tell. If there's anyone in there from this side. We do have the sneak over trash um thing now, so nope, no zombo in there. Nice. Armor parts and commando boots. 2% run speed. Use no stamina while sneak sprinting. That is a good one. Take it for sure. A moi drawer. Nice. More armor parts. Okay, we'll take it. Shit. Dude, you scared the hell out of me. And you infected me too. Damn it. You act just like a zombie. Oh, wait. Ugh, okay. Yucca juice smoothie and beer. Nice. Uh, chicken ration. You know what? We're not actually hungry right at the moment, though, so let's save that. Okay, let's get rid of that. Oh, I think I'm going to get rid of the chamois, too. Okay, pretty sure we're going to have a dog or a zombo, or maybe both, back here. And they come out of this door here. Or 
there's three of them. Alright. So we better take one of these, because that hurt like a mother. We also have a concussion, and we don't have anything on us right now. We did, we got stuff out on the bike for that. Okay, so since we have three of these guys, um, let's reinforce that door and... Uh, how about if we put a hatch down? Okay, let's go back outside for a minute and get uh, get a pain pill out of here to deal with our concussion. Otherwise, our head's going to be spinning quite literally. And we'll also take one of those for the infection. And now we have a fucking broken arm, so I guess we need one of these too. 24 minutes. Okay, yeah, that all hurt. I think we're I think we're fixed up now though. I'd use my sledge except for that my you know, my, my arm's all buggered up, and the sledge is just going to exacerbate it, so. We shall not do that. Incidentally, we need to get this, too. All right, so we got the satchel. Yeah, so this is this is one of those trigger situations. It doesn't matter how stealthy you are. It's just they're just gonna come after you. Do we get honey from these? I don't think so, but let's just double check. Supposedly these are beehives. No. Nope. I think this place has an underground bunker at the end. Reload you. Get the wood. No honey there. No honey there. Is there anything up here? It's a trash. got a thousand hit points so no we're not gonna easily be breaking into that thing everybody loaded yes indeed okay don't remember if there's yep. there are Zeke's in here all right there's three of them and one of them is a lumberjack And a Hawaii Five O. Go back to here since we still have our hatch down. Okay, we'll just wait for them to come into here.
Okay, he's down. And then we have a female Zombo and a Hawaii Five-O. I don't, I don't remember who the female was. Arlene, maybe. Just wait for them to work their way up here. Come on, guys. Let's go. Don't got all day. Damn it, Jim. I don't have time for this shit. Kind of like stuck where he can't really do much, it looks like. All right, Hawaii 5 O's down. She must be. Yeah, she's stuck too. All right. So the rest of the Zeeks are just going to be the ones I think down in the bunker. And we have more corn seed that we can grab here, too. Plus, I need to go back to that apartment building that had all that corn seed. Uh, I don't want that. What do we get for wrenching these? Nice. <clears throat> Iron ingots, electrical, and mechanical parts. That doesn't suck. That opens that up. Okay. Check the trash. Everybody loaded? Yep. All right. Let's go. Sure haven't pulled much honey out of the honey farms. Somebody in here. Or not. Yeah, I, s I see them, but can't get to them from here. Take the shotgun shells. And a trap crafting. That's going to be a tough headshot. All right, who are we dealing with? We have two Zoms. I'll give you guys a, a double there. And we're done. Nice. Um, yeah, we're pretty decently hungry and we're thirsty and we could use a little health. So let's just eat that right now. That was a nice find. Good, good. Check the fat loots. Enforcer, sprinting with a 44 gun drawn in combat uses 20% less stamina. And we got a, a big custom fittings mod. And another thingy of Enforcer sunglasses. And we've also pulled four armor parts out of this place. That's not bad. I'd like to... Uh, I'd like to make the mining set... Yeah, let's drink that. Soup stock is used in a recipe. We'll use those blueberries to make some pie. Yeah, that's used for gumbo, so we'll hang on to... Oh, shit. That scared me. <laughs> Get a little 
plastic. And I believe we're done here. All right, we gotta hurry. Uh, I'll meet you guys back at Wrecked for the turn in. Let's check this on the way back. Uh, okay, we can sell that then. Vehicles, and we'll sell whatever that is because we've already read it. Machine gunner, fully automatic fires more accurate with each shot fired. Very nice. Hello, Rex. Oh, let me get. You think you're pretty smart now, don't you? Talking shells, vehicles. Pay Einstein. Think we'll take the crafting skill magazine. What's it gonna be? Uh huh? And we're gonna sell you this and this. And didn't I loot a pipe weapon to sell him? I must have. I must have left it back at the base. So okay. Um, I don't. Don't think I want to sell him anything else at the moment. All right, so let's. All right, now take that a job. we're done doing business, get out of my store. We have. Listen up, jackass. Porter's house. Work? Then show some respect. That place has a lot of resources. Yeah, let's take that next. Uh, let's get one thing straight. You're not working with me. You're working for me. All right, I think we're done with him. My candy. What does that do? Well, that's the loot bonus one. Rockbusters would be nice for harvesting. 300 coin. I mean, yeah, that's still a bit steep for us. We could we could do it, but I think we'll wait just a little bit longer till we have a little bit more cash flow before we start buying candy. I didn't leave that in here, did I? No, I didn't. Okay. All right, ladies and gents, that is going to be it for this episode. Thank God it's almost closing time. Thank I've God. Bullshit for one day. <laughs> so I'm going to, uh, I'm probably just going to go ahead and do some more mining overnight. And then in the morning, we'll just keep on keeping on doing more jobs, going through more POIs and continue on uh, with that as we advance in the game. Uh, I might look at, in fact, here, before I let you go, let's take a quick look at what it would take to... Uh, oh, shit, I forgot to do the enforcer glasses. We have two of these now, so I should fix one up and sell it. Um, but what would it take to make the mining armor set? Uh, wait, what? Oh, it's minor. That's why. Okay, so. So all of these just take one crafting kit and five leather. That's relatively cheap. And that requires. Yeah, we could do this. We could do this um, because I have four armor parts. And then I have sewing kits and duct tape, or I can make those things. Oh, let's uh, look at these two. So two more cooking, two traps, and two more tactical warfare. Now I can make a level two, uh, quality two AK. I might do that, actually, uh, as well. So yeah, I think what I'll do is I'll make the I'll make the mining set because I don't think I have any mining pieces. Uh, I'll make an orange AK and a blue pipe shotgun. And then I'm probably just going to, like I said, go out and uh, mine for the rest of the night. I got a couple of fairly deep mines now that I should be able to get hopefully far enough underground to not attract attention. And then I'll see you guys in the morning and we will proceed from there. We don't have, oh, we do have a point. Okay. Do we have any achievements that we've also finished? Wait, okay, no achievements, but we do have the point. Um, I think I said I was going to go ahead and put that into well insulated. Let's just do it because we know we're going to need it. And then starting with the next point, the plan is to start, I think, pumping strength. Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. I think we'll pump strength because then it's going to benefit us for shoddies, for skull crusher, 
and for the two mining skills, those in particular, and maybe, you know, even putting a point or eventually four into heavy armor would be a good idea too. Thanks everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.